What is up you guys? So, I'm coming back at you with another new video. And this is inspired by Taylor Cut Films and he uses this transition a lot. So here's what we're going to replicate. First, you're going to need your two two clips. Um We'll just have our two clips right here. And then first thing we're going to do is we're going to bring that second clip over the first one. And also he likes to do this with like lights and stuff. So I'm just showing this with um, a light. Yeah, so first what we're going to do is hop onto effects and then we're going to search up uh, Luma Key. Um, drag it onto the second clip. And here you already see we have like this, it's popping up already. So he likes to start off with this already, so we don't need to keyframe that in the beginning to make it blend to it. We're going to keep this like that, and then we're going to go to Threshold, and then go a little bit forward, and then we're going to go all the way to zero. Now as you can see, it blends in just like that. And it's so simple, so easy. And yeah, it just looks pretty cool, especially with the light. So yeah. But another thing you can do is sometimes he likes to likes to make it blend into the first one. So we can start our opacity at zero, and then it already made a keyframe for us. And then go, go, oh, it started at one. Let's go back to zero. Um, go here. And then we can blend it just a bit, and then it fades into that. But over here, we have to keep this at 100, so. But he usually doesn't really do that whole opacity thing. I think it looks cooler without it, so. This is how we're gonna... This is the quickest tutorial ever, so easy. But so cool. So yeah, if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.